Hey Brazen, happy Saturday. Um, we have a somewhat grim workout today. Uh, you'll probably be saying that once you get through it. So we have a 20 minute death by workout of three dumbbell full cleans and three odd object ground overheads. What this, this death by means is that we're going to be adding one rep each one of these rounds. So if you're in class with me tomorrow at 9.30, we're going to set a 20 minute clock that's gonna beep every minute or so, and you're going to be adding a rep each of those minutes. So that means first round, you have three dumbbell full cleans, three odd object ground overheads. Second round, you have four dumbbell full cleans, four odd object ground overheads. Third round, I'm not gonna go through all 20 rounds, but you start to get the picture. So once you get to 20 rounds, you're gonna be about, what are you? 23 dumbbell full cleans. 22. 22 dumbbell full cleans. And 22 odd object ground overheads. In my view, that's a lot to do, but I'm sure some of you guys can do that. Um, the goal is to finish all of that. For that, you're gonna have to move, be moving very quickly. Um, this is gonna be a very intense workout once you hit probably 10 rounds or so. Um, so keep that in mind. <clears throat> now, once you die, you have the afterlife. Luckily, we have the afterlife. Um, otherwise, you know, you may be sitting around once you, quote, die. The afterlife is an AMRAP until we get to that 20 minutes of five dumbbell cleans. Those will be full cleans. 10 alternating push press and 15 plate taps. So if I'm looking at this workout, I'm actually thinking I want to stay alive because this afterlife looks a little bit difficult. So um, to go over these movements, dumbbell full cleans. When we say full clean, right? Whether it's with dumbbells, kettlebell, barbell, um, RIP barbell, at least for now. We should be back soon. Uh, that's starting from the ground, going into a full squat. If we added a hang to there, it would start from the hang. If we added a power to there, we wouldn't go into a full squat. I don't see power anywhere here, so those are dumbbell full cleans. Dumbbell full cleans, starting from the ground. Let's make sure we have these dumbbells at about mid shin. So, you know, when you're lifting a barbell, obviously we start from mid shin. We don't wanna be hunched over like so, um, just because we don't wanna curl our back over like that. We wanna load our hamstring, starting at mid shin, cleaning them up, and then going into a full squat and standing back up. Going back to the ground, Full squat, standing back up. So the first round you can see, you have three of those, moves pretty quickly. Then these three odd object ground overhead. So you can use whatever is in your room. We've got a dog over there. Um, we've got medicine ball. We've got dumbbell, kettlebell. Uh, I'm gonna show it with a plate carrier or weighted vest, you can use a weighted vest. Imagine this is a plate. We're just gonna start the ground using our hips, driving that up overhead, round overhead. If you use the medicine ball, ground overhead. Still opening up my hips. This will translate to our full cleans, translate to our snatches, all that fun stuff. So that's what we're gonna do, remember, on the minute, we're gonna add a rep till we, you know, die. And then we move to the afterlife. So these five dumbbell full cleans, you just saw those. 10 alternating push press. So push press is dip, drive, lockout. If it was a push jerk, it would be dip, drive, push underneath it. But we're doing push press. So dip, drive, lockout. Same weight as our full cleans. Dip, drive, lockout bring it back, dip, drive, lock out, other side. So as you can see, alternating. 10 of those, and then finally, 15 plate taps. So if you're using a plate for your ground overhead, uh, you can do your plate taps there. If you're using a dumbbell, or you can just actually pick something that's elevated off the ground, trash can, whatever, we're just going to tap, Alternate, staying nice and light on our feet. That's gonna jack up your heart rate. All of these are gonna jack up your heart rate. 
That's going to be a heart rate. So, we've got a nice elevated heart rate workout for you tomorrow. I will see you at 9.30. Let us know if you need anything or have any questions.